Bahamas Telecommunications Company CEO Garfield Sinclair admitting to our news team that he takes full responsibility for several of BTC's retail outlets across the Bahamas being closed today. A statement issued to our news team confirmed that retail outlets at the Mall at Marathon, Southwest Plaza, Governor's Harbor and Spanish Wells, Eleuthera, Georgetown Exuma, Pioneer's Way in Freeport, Grand Bahama, Marsh Harbor, Abaco, Deadman's Key, Long Island, Crooked Island, Cat Island, Acklands and San Salvador were all closed today. While apologizing to customers for the inconvenience, Mrs. Sinclair told our news team why he believes the retail outlets were closed. Most of my colleagues um, called in, or many of them anyway, I shouldn't say most, many of them called in sick uh, and, and just didn't report to work uh, for one reason or another. I suspect it is part of an overall uh, industrial action, but the precise reason for this action, I must tell you, is mostly lost on me. Well, he couldn't specify the no-show by employees is, if the no-show by employees is industrial related, BTC CEO did say that as far as he's concerned, negotiations between BTC and its unions have been cordial. We have an outstanding uh, collective bargaining agreement now. It's been outstanding two and a half years. I've been here since August and I have resolved and undertaken to ensure that on my watch we are going to finally sign an agreement. But I've been at it since August. It's been outstanding for two years. Uh, but more importantly than that, I thought we were making some pretty good progress. We've been meeting every week, closing gap on some of the areas where we were apart. Um, so I thought those negotiations were going well. 